Okay, we back, we thriving. It's a great day to be alive. I've been trying to pack and I have no idea what to pack because, well, let's just kind of backtrack a little bit. So this summer I was originally going to go to Atlanta and get in some movies. I was gonna do like some auditions and stuff. So last minute I got invited to go to China. When I found out I was going to China, I first started going on YouTube looking up about China. Like, I know nothing about China. Literally, I feel like over here in the West, we hear all these, like, propaganda things about China. And it's just, like, we're just trained to not think really good about China just because the U.S. and China has kind of, like, a trade war going on. And we, I mean, obviously, they're our biggest competitor, so we are kind of trained not to think the best about China. If you're watching this, leave any comments below if you've been to China, what your thoughts on China are, or just anything, like inform me because I really do not know what I'm getting myself into right now. So any comments would really help me a lot. So yeah, without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so this first look is very basic and I feel like this is more like street style and I really wanted something like comfortable but still stylish and I got this top from Brandy it's a beige basic top I mean <laughs> basic I don't know what I was trying to do there. I was trying to make it funny, but it just didn't happen to be funny. So I actually paired it with this gold chain and I actually have like multiple gold chains, but I feel like just one is enough and it kind of just like makes it look a little bit better. We got this beige top with this gold necklace and then to go with it, I'm wearing my snake earrings. I got these from Urban. I really like these and they're just little snakes and I really like the gold look with the beige. It looks so good to me. Any like way I'm wearing my hair is not how I'm going to wear my hair with the look. I'm just pulling it back so you guys can see the outfit better. To go with it, I'm wearing my Michael Kors watch and it's like rose gold so I feel like it kind of matches. And then I am just wearing my black Chanel purse which I kind of wear this with everything. I feel like it kind of just spices up every outfit. It's just the basic, and then it has the gold detailing, which I felt like it goes good with my gold jewelry. And for my bottoms, I'm wearing these army green, I don't know what these are called. They're just like army green pants, but I feel like there's a name for them. I forgot. I got these from Fashion Nova, and I like it because they have like pockets on the side. I'll have everything linked below, or at least try to have everything linked below. And the main thing I like about these pants is it's like, cuffed at the ankle so it makes them like a tighter look and then as for shoes okay so long story short i don't actually own the air force ones like the white air force ones so i'm actually going to get them tomorrow so right now i'm just wearing my nike my red nike shoes i actually kind of like these but i just feel like they don't go with this outfit i'm thinking about wearing this hat to go with it so i'm just gonna see what it looks like Maybe if I wear a hat, I'll fit in a little bit more. Like, people won't be like, um, who's that girl? This next outfit is for, like, one of those days you're like, I'm here, but I don't want to be here. It's like you want to try, but you don't. But you're still out there. You're still thriving, you know? I'm trying to, like, brush my hair after that freaking hat this is why i don't wear hats on a daily again the top is from brandy i feel like i get all my basics from brandy so if you're wondering brandy i don't know like this is so thin so you could literally wear this in the summer or like if you're going out to eat and you're not trying to like flash everyone you know what i mean so this is more for like just like a casual day like shopping going out not really like doing too much and i'm wearing this really cute tan backpack with it. I feel like this would go so well with this. For jewelry, again, I'm just wearing the Michael Kors watch. I feel like this is like my baby. It goes with everything. And for my necklace, this is, it has a little flower on it. And I got this from Urban. And for my earrings, I actually got these from Urban. I really like them. They're just like gold and it has a cross on it. Okay, and for my pants, I'm actually wearing these basic light wash jeans from Urban. I really like these. I feel like they just go with everything and they're so simple. And also I like it because they're not like super skinny. They kind of have like a little bit of a flare at the end, like a little bit. I don't know if you guys can tell. 
And then for my shoes, you would have never expected this, but I really wanted to wear these heels. They're very casual, actually. First of all, these shoes, like they're, they look pretty high, but they're actually very comfortable to walk in. They add a little pop to your wardrobe. So I really like wearing these with this because you're like, wow, she looks casual. And then you look down and you're like, okay, this girl has style. This next outfit is kind of one of my favorites. It's like probably the most casual-ish. But I just want to make a little disclaimer before I show you guys. I am trying to reuse a lot of my items. Like I'm trying to reuse my shoes a lot because honestly, I don't want to bring like 13 million pairs of shoes with me halfway across the world. And I actually made that mistake when I spent a summer in Spain. When I tell you, it's so hard to travel when you have like a new pair of shoes for every outfit or like a new purse for every outfit. It's just, it's just very hard to travel. So for this trip, I just thought it'd be a good idea to try to reuse certain pieces in my outfits because then I don't have to bring as much with me. For my jewelry up here, what we got going on, um, I have these adorable freaking earrings from Bobble Bar. And these are my first piece of jewelry from Bobble Bar. So I am like obsessed with them low key. They're really big and they stand out. They're like a neon yellowish color. And I don't know, I love like the detailing on them and they're super cute. And I felt like it really goes well with like blue, like yellow and blue kind of go together for me. For my necklace, I decided to wear this again. It's just like a gold chain necklace. I tried to use a lot of gold throughout this look. You can tell why in a second. It just really goes good with like blue and jeans and I don't know, I kind of like it so. And then for my bracelet, I tried to stay away from my watch. So I tried to spice it up a little bit. So I just put on this gold bracelet that I got from a store called Francesca's. And then for my ring, I'm wearing this, I wish I could, I don't know why it's not focusing today, but a white diamond and then a green diamond. Yeah, and then over here, honestly, this is like the only silver piece of jewelry I own, but it's like a snake. It's kind of cute. I don't know. I don't know why I paired it with this because I told you guys I'm wearing all gold, but I wanted an excuse to wear it, so I just I was like, you know what? I'm going to do it. So that's for my rings. For my actual outfit, I'm just wearing this blue and white cropped tank top from Brandy Melville. It's actually a new item, so I will have it linked below. And it's perfect for summer. It's very like lightweight and super just, I don't know. I feel like I can actually like wear this out and not feel hot. And then there's like three little buttons over here, which are super cute. I like that. And then for my skirt, I got this skirt from Target. And then I'm wearing this Brandy Melville belt, which I feel like it kind of just like completes the entire look. Okay, so I have two purses I'm debating on. This is my first Chanel purse I have. And then I also have the black Chanel. So I have no idea which one I'm going to wear with this. I feel like this one just looks more casual, just going out on the town, walking around, you know, just a basic purse. And then this one, a lot more, it makes the look a lot more dressy. So I don't really know. I don't know if I want to bring this big purse with me though because it's kind of big. So I don't know if I want to like lug this to China. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know. And then for shoes, like I said, I'm wearing my black heels, which you guys already saw in my other outfits. So if you guys can, let me know below rating wise, which outfit you like the best and just like rate my outfits for me because I like to know if you guys like my style as well or if you hate it, be honest. Like just go off in the comments. I mean like don't be too mean because I'm human too. I like honesty, it really means a lot to me. So yeah, go do that for me. Okay, this next outfit, I'm really feeling it. I actually think I like this one the best to be honest. I am just wearing these gold hoops. Not much explaining needed. This gold necklace. <laughs> I know, I have worn this in like every outfit, but you know what, I really like the gold. I'm just already getting into the gold. And then I'm wearing my watch for this. It just makes me feel badass. So I'm wearing this black blazer that I got from H&M. It's just literally a black blazer. And then I feel like rolling up the sleeves will kind of make it a little bit like more fashionable and so you can see the watch. And then I'm wearing this brandy tank top and it just has like this black 
leopard print on it, which I feel like it goes really good with the blazer. And then I'm wearing these biker shorts that I also got from Brandy. And I feel like it'll look really cute if I just like button it so you can like see the leopard a little bit. For my shoes, I love the detailing. It has like this like green threading through it. You can just slip these on really quick and honestly, they kind of complete my outfit. Okay, wow, we have come to an end. I really hope you guys enjoyed this week's video and if you enjoyed it, Give me some love so I can give you guys some love back. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button because I will be posting a part two to this. And China vlogs and summer vlogs and fitness and anything you guys want to see. So just hit that subscribe button. Do me a favor and I'll see you guys in next week's video. Bye. Okay, I want to know why I was filming this entire time and um, there was lipstick off my lip. Like, thanks for telling me, guys. Thanks. Why do I look like a bronze goddess? Like, okay. I mean, I'll work with it. Let me know. Okay, this next outfit, it really spoke to me. And this is me. This was by far my favorite outfit, and I wanted to share it with you guys. So, we got the bling bling gold chain. We got the toboggan going on. We got the polo. We got the Nike speaking to us over here. And of course, can't forget the Nike slides. Slide those babies on, you good to go. Oh my God, that was so bad. I'm just, I give up on life, okay. I hate when I like kiss the camera because then I have like lipstick all over me, but you know what, it's fine, it's for you. So, I love you.